You know, we work hard all week, and this is the way that I choose to relax and celebrate another day well lived. This wonderful cigar is a legal product, enjoyed by millions for hundreds of years. Now in August 2016, the new Food and Drug Administration rules went into effect regulating premium cigars, and they were harsh. 499 pages of new and strict cigar regulations, each one filled with measures, rulings, definitions, and fees that completely overstepped the authority that the FDA was given by Congress to regulate tobacco. Now here's how and why it matters. By implementing the deeming rule, the FDA will be regulating the cigar industry like the cigarette business. In fact, maybe even worse. We're talking full government control, deciding which cigar brands stay on the market. They even want to control the tobacco blending process for cigars because the agency wants to approve the cigar before it can even be sold. They're going to force cigar makers to disclose their family recipes and even their plans on how they're going to advertise the cigars. That means prices are going to go up to cover costly testing fees to get that FDA seal of approval. And cigar makers are going to be required to pay user fees to fund the FDA's further tobacco regulation efforts. If your favorite cigar shop creates cigar samplers or blends house pipe tobacco, they'll be subjected to even harsher regulations too, even more taxes and fees. And they won't even be able to create any new sampler packs either. Hey, you want to try a new cigar? Well, buyer beware, because free samples are banned at cigar shops. No more freebies, ever. There's much more to these outrageous rules. And not only are they unfair to business, they're breaking the law. With new health warning labels, the FDA is breaching the First Amendment by limiting the ability of cigar manufacturers to bring new blends to market, or even make and sell cigars in some cases. The FDA is forcing companies out of the market without due process, a violation of the Fifth Amendment. They're violating the Regulatory Flexibility Act with these new costs and fees, and this whole big overreach violates the Administrative Procedure Act. Remember to be vigilant. Stand up for your rights and don't let anybody take away what is rightfully yours. Thanks so much. And for you cigar smokers out there, continue to smoke them because you love them.